Hey guys, my name is Cineac and welcome back to Fool's Town here in City Skylines. Now guys, last episode, and I say the last two episodes, we've been working heavily on the brand new Industries DLC and added to the city where today we're going to take a step back from it. We're going to focus back onto the city and add some more functionality and add something extra to it. Now, what I want to do today is eventually set up like a big grand central park area. But I also want to add in a bunch of brand new low residential areas or kind of start to get them set up with some, uh, let's just say we're going to give them some uneducated people. That's kind of what the city needs right now. We need a little bit more uneducated people. Now, this new area that I got want to sell up, it's not too far from the main town anyway. It's kind of integrated within it, just kind of expanding the city slightly. But I try, I, I want to try not to include much public transport or, you know, good links. Because if I do, they're able to get to and from the education systems a lot easier and be educated. And that's kind of not what I want. So, that's my main focus coming soon. But uh, I always want to be that central park. So... We're back in the city and it's looking as beautiful as ever. We still have a few little issues and problems uh, lying around. Uh, these guys, uh, you know, suffering really bad. I've been thinking about it as well. Because this is getting heavily used, we can, like, benefit from this and put, like, a little toll road in there, maybe. I don't know. Do you know what? I'm going to do it and see how it plays out. It could be a good idea. It ultimately could be a bad idea if I can fit one in. It's quite... Oh, that fits in quite perfect, doesn't it? Right, okay. And then... Get a road like that. I need quite... Oh, can I get a bigger road than that? If I give that big boy hi highway. We'll see. But what's happening is now then is this is literally a toll road. We'll up the prices. It's not to make any profit or anything like that. Was my last... Oh, my last road was a two-way, wasn't it? Hold on. Hold on. I've done this wrong. It was a two-way road I had. So I need a two-way toll road. Toll road? Toll road. <laughs> there we go. Is that the way it goes? Oh, it doesn't really matter which way it goes in, to be honest now, does it? Yeah, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to need this one then. So there's no... Ifs or buts about it. So yeah, it's not to make any profit, it's just like not everyone's going to choose to want to go this way just because it is a toll road. Now, it might, it might, and I say it might, it's going to back up a lot of traffic. It's going to back up a lot of traffic. We'll just wait for the initial flow to go through. And we should really set up some lane detection here too. Right, let's sort this out then. So, this can go straight on. This one goes to there, and then we have these two in the middle. So that can go that way or that way, and then obviously this one can go either there or there. So how do they like that? Are they impressed with this? If I remove the traffic lights on that road, are they gonna are they gonna play nicely? It's actually going to build up some traffic, isn't it? Maybe this is not the best option for me. It's probably not the best option. You know what? Get rid of it. We tried, guys. We tried, but ultimately, we failed. Don't worry. We'll get him next time. <laughs> right, which is now... Because I've done all that, it's now going to have messed up dramatically all my little connections. So just get the traffic flowing back again. There we go. We'll leave it like that. I may have broken it, but it's fine. We've learned our lesson. Anyway, let's get out of there. So this is the area where I want to add in some new residential. Just to kind of eventually push the city over. It's going to be all, all low residential. And I think I'm going to just get rid of this here for now. And then replace it down in a better kind of a uh, way. So I want to create like a, a, a much better curve. There we go. And I've been thinking that I eventually cross cross it over. So if we go, I'll get this straight and then kind of ramp it up. Is it not going to go over? Maybe I rammed it up too early. So go as close as possible. 
There we go, and then ramp it down. So that will eventually connect to this side once we get over there. Uh, but then I want to create a nice little road. So I'm not going to make it all gritty. I want to make it all bendy and whatnot and windy. So we'll have like a road that kind of comes to about there. And we'll have it bend round. So I try my best now. There we go. And this one can come up. Like that. And we'll do like little cuts coming off it and whatnot. There we go. So little cuts coming off it. We'll just use like the straight roads system now then. Now nah, we'll keep the bends on that. I like the bends. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Like that. Oh, I like this. I like this a lot. So these bends are ultimately what makes this whole area. Again, it's all going to be low residential area. I like that little kind of end in there. It's really nice. It's all going to be low residential, so there's not going to be any major traffic destructions. There we go. Beautiful. Let me delete that. There we go. Is that good enough? That looks kind of dope, doesn't it? I really do like that. I want to continue it over here too. So we have a connection there. And we have a connection here. So let's start with the connection here. And we'll try and bring it in. Like that. There we go. That's actually really dope. I like this little area. Okay. So let's connect all this up with water then. So let's bring it all over. Oh, I'm surprised those guys up there don't have any water. Hook up all the pipage. And then can I do that whole area in one go? Yes, boy! There we go. Nice. Have I, is that area been fixed yet? No, the traffic is deadly. Okay, so by dealing that road, it, it looks like I got rid of all my major connection issues that I had originally here. So that's going to be such a huge pain. Right, what we'll do, I'll come back to that in just a second. I'm going to zone all this because I know it's going to take a while to get it all built. So I'll zone it all first. And then we'll come back to it. So we'll start on this side. I'm going to quickly pause them while I get it all, all painted in. So we'll start over here. Once that starts to get, like build up. We'll then go kind of manage that traffic problem that I've now created. I might as well just connect it all the way through here as well. Uh, there we go. So I also want to pretty much get all this zoned as well. Everything but this little road. So it's a lot of residential we're getting in. So let it do what it's got to do. Anyway, so we'll come back to that in just a second. Let me re-add in the connections that I've now got rid. So how it works is then, if you're going to go in that direction, you're going to go there. Oh, 
Or there. Or there. Right, so they're going to switch lanes at various points. So we need to make sure that they don't switch and they already know where they need to go. Like that. And then this one here, this also does something like this. So you can go that direction, or you can cut into the middle there, which is fine. That'll keep the traffic flowing. And then once it gets to here, then it can go any, pretty much any way it wants. And it, it can kind of, it all filters down nicely, which is really good. So we also need all this one to filter across as well for the people coming from that side. So it does work. That should now get rid of all this. This backup will take a while to disappear. Just because we've now kind of sorted that out. But now the traffic's flowing here. There's no reason for it now to start all flowing up here. Just got to give it a few mementos to get rid of the slight little build-up. Okay. So how are we doing over here then? Okay, we only got a couple of houses in to begin with. Right, okay. So while that does that then, I want to build my little national park area. And I'm thinking this top of this border area here is the perfect location for it. Now my park area is, if I can remember exactly where it was. Uh, is this it? No, amusement park, zoo, national reserve. That's what I mean, my national reserve. We also have park maintenance and props. So the national reserve is what I want up here. Which we've got quite a few cool things that we can add in. There's also like fishing cabins. Oh, there's no water up here, is there? We could maybe, maybe, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But this is ultimately where I want it to be. Now, we need a really good road connection leading up to here. So I could, because eventually this area has been built up to there. Uh, but we need a highway connection. And the highway is too complex there. So it's probably best if this eventually runs down to here. Maybe create a connection off there to here. Then the highway comes to there and stops. And then we can have our little reserve up there. So it means I need to get the highways in. Which means, and I know you guys love this. I know you guys love this. And by love this, and you know, you make fun of me for this with all my roundabouts. We're going roundabout crazy again, guys. So we'll have a roundabout here. And then what we'll do, we'll have one. Now what's that? That's quite a big slope, isn't it? So we'll have the, the, the one there. Which ultimately we could connect it up to there, but we'll kind of see how it goes. So delete all the off bits there. So that's going to come down to there. That's going to bend round to there. That's going to go down to there. And that's ultimately all I want it to do. Right, sweet, mate. Okay, so we'll start then with this road. So we get some nice little bend on the go. To there. And I need the road to go back. Connecting that beauty back up. And then we need a road coming from, let's do this side here then. So bring it to there. Oh, press the wrong button. Nice. So bring that to there. Oh, oh I keep pressing the wrong button. There we go. Sweet, mate. And then we need to hook up this one as well. So straight to there. Connection straight back up. Okay, so that is our new highly integrated highway. We see how long this works for. <laughs> right, okay. So let's create the connections then. We only need to do the connection. Yeah, let's start up here. So we'll create that one there. Hopefully it all goes well in that section. Right, take off my little snapping grid. Right, 
Right, we'll sort out the little slight deform issues in just a moment. Alright, get you there. Nice. So move it towards just gonna kind of focus on some of this stuff. There we go, that one's perfect. There we go. These ones look a little bit funky. Oh, I wonder where they're going. So they're choosing to go where? Where are they choosing to go? Okay, they seem to be going round and then back up, I, I assume. Yeah, I'm not sure why they're doing that. That's kind of funny. Oh, I reckon because it's only... Yeah, it's... Oh, I get what it's trying to do right now. All right, everyone's going that way. But if you're locked in this, this lane already, you're going to go that way. So they'll eventually filter themselves out. That's funny. Right. Did I finish that one up? Create a bit of bend on it. Yes. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Right. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. Okay. So we need to turn this into a nature reserve. So let's zone that area first to become the nature reserve. How do I zone it now? So how do we zone the park? I forget how we zone this stuff. Industry, commercial, office, residential. I honestly forget how we zone this stuff now. So when we did like uh, the zoo here. No. Oh, the city park. Oh, that's a tough one now. Do I did it? No, I'm gonna make it the nature reserve. Or the city park. See, this is tough. This is tough now. Is it the city park I'm doing or the nature reserve? I feel like it would be better to be the nature reserve up here. So we go with that. Right, okay. So do we have an entrance for it? Main gate. Nature is small. We want this, don't we? But we've got to place it next to a road. So we'll have then the big boy going up. So, make a nice little straight-ish road. So, about there. That just literally comes down to here. And then with the magic of bendy roads. Just does that. And then we'll create a nice little one-way system loop. And we'll do something, something like this. Nothing too crazy. Just like that there. Let's go back a bit. There we go. That's a little bit better. And we'll connect it up eventually. But that's that's ultimately what I want it to be. Little nice little one-way loop system. So we have our nice little main gate. Looking good. There we go. That's how we zone it. I always forget how we zone this stuff. So um erase park, paint park. There we go. The Cypress National Park. I'm gonna pull it all the way around. Is that on the biggest one? No, there we go. That's the biggest one. Put it all the way around here on top of the mound. It's a nice little place for a national park. I'd love to go there because you have really good views of the city then, won't you? There we go. You have, Okay, look at the, the views you have of the city then. And all the issues the city's got. Have we got a lot of death issues? Is that one of the scene then? Yeah, we kind of have. Right, we'll solve those a little bit later. How's that residential doing? It's coming along. Slowly. <laughs> right, back to this. So National Park, and so we've got the Reserve Main Gate, we have the Reserve Side Gate, we have the Campfire. Ooh. Okay, so before we do all that then, let's actually get the pathing and stuff like that. 
So reserve with decorations, uh, uh, path mineral nature reserve path. Let's do with the decorations first. How does this look? So if I went like straight like that, oh I like it. It's got like little lampposts and lights on. It's got all the little stones and stuff. So we'll make a. We'll, do you know what I do? We'll first we'll create a loop around the edge. Like this. So you can walk around the edge of the national park. And then bring it back around. To there. Now where's the edge over here? It's just over here. So we do a smaller turn. Right, that's the outer loop, which looks, that looks like so good. That looks so good. And we create like a load of like, ran, not random, but like a load of then connections. So, so just do that to there. That's the straightest road we're going to have. So let's take off the grid again. And then from this point, we have many different end connections. So do stuff like that. So there we go. That is our beautiful national park. I'm feeling like we should do a path up here too. Like that. Okay, that is the path work for it. Nice. We'll eventually do a fence a little bit later, but let's do this then. So we've got them. Uh, campfire site one, site two, and then we've got tents. So a small open hut. Or we've got campfire site. Right. Let's do the first campfire site. Let's do it like, uh, let's do it over here. So we, a nice little campfire there. It needs to be connected to a road. Is that what it needs to be? No path or road. Let me move that. How close does it need to be? Okay, right. Fine. Um, and then we have little tents. Is that the right one? Yeah. These tents are actually quite small, aren't they? Oh, this is going to annoy me so bad that these tents need to be so close to the, to the road. How close are we talking right now? Well, do you know what I could do? I could push that back slightly. And just do a none. Decorative path like that. That's kind of an... It, it's kind of annoying-ish, but it is what it is, right? So, then we've got tent one there. Then we've got some slightly bigger tents. So we do a couple there, and we got some big boy ones. Uh, can you, you can actually connect them to the road, which is kind of cool. But I like them being slightly, just slight, lightly off as well. How does that look there? A little campfire. A few little tents there. Nice little campsite. I like that. I like that. What else have we got to throw down then? We've got stuff like a viewing deck. Uh, a viewing deck two. How far can we... Oh, we can put... Oh, these are so good. Guys, these are so good. Oh, yes, please, mate. Them viewing decks is coming off there. I'm going to play some every so often. And like certain points of the viewing. Oh, I love this. I love where I've chose to place it too. Because it really does now take effect that you can stand on the edge and overlook that huge area. 
Oh, that is so good. I'm so impressed with that. Right. We've also got a uh, tent camp in site one. So we'll place a few of these down then. So let's do one there. Try to squeeze it in just right. There we go. One there. Uh, and we do like a few little tents again. How does that look? It actually looks pretty dope, doesn't it? It does actually look pretty dope when you look at it like that. Okay. So we've also got the... What's this? This is a lean-to shelter. Small wooden shelter with a campfire. We also have lean-to shelter 2 and stuff like that. So these are a little bit bigger. Let's get that path again, the non-decorative one. Just like that, so we can just add some more detail to this. There we go, and we get the bigger ones. And what's this here? This is a Lookout Tower 1. So we've got Lookout Tower 1 and 2. And we'll place some over here. So we use Lookout Towers in various spots, couldn't we? There we go, drop one there. Because it is the nature reserve, you are going to be looking out for various stuff. What's this now? This is a camping site one. Ooh, this is a big boy one. This is definitely a big boy one. Right, let's um, let's do some more of this path then. So we're just going to connect this to here. Just like that. Alright, let's destroy that one. So pretty much what I'm doing is creating the camping loop. That is ultimately what we're going for right now. So we want then this little camping site, which I'll squeeze on just there. And we'll throw in another one. If we can get it in with no issues, just there. So how do they look? They're actually pretty dope as well. we got to place so many trees in, in this area too. Okay. So then this is all water stuff. Like fishing cabin. Uh, fishing cabin there. Hunting cabin. Ooh, hunting cabin. So we'll, we'll dot these around in various spots. And again, you got to remember, we've got a place in so many trees. we got lookouts too. We'll place them near like the lookouts. We have the boulder site. We have those big, big rocks just chilling. We've got stuff like uh, reserve benches. Oh, they're tiny. Oh, they've got more around the campfires anyway. So we need to actually place the majority of those in. Canoes and stuff like that. Wells. Is this CCTV? Oh, public binoculars. Do we have them on the on the decks? Oh, we do anyway. Okay. So I want to place in some trees then. So where's my trees at? There we go. What trees have we currently got down? Is that like them? Medium trees. Large. We can get away with that, right? Yeah. Right, we're going to up our brush size. Put down the brush strength. Just paint it in slightly. Let's do some on the mountainside. There we go. And we do like different type of trees now. Should we do like these big giant redwoods? Noise. And let's do some like small little bushes. There 
dotting around. That's actually pretty dope, isn't it? And then we've got uh, these large bushes. We've got to make it more foresty because it isn't. It is this little nature reserve, and a few little trees there. Let's go for some large trees again. Put my brush strength up now. How mad is this going to take it? Oh, that looks so good. Just did a brush strength around the edges of it. Guys, that looks so dope, that na nature reserve. Oh, I'm so impressed. Right, we need water then, connecting that there. Does it need power? I'm not sure. I'm actually not sure if it needs power. Do you have anyone here yet? Not yet. And do I create a parking lot? Hmm. My thought process is yes, create a parking lot. Should we do it off dirt roads? Yeah, why not? So let's go straight roads of this. Uh, just like that then, that's fine. So parking lot. Get rid of that one there. Ah! Right at the end when I was trying to turn it. There we go. Took a while. <laughs> right, how does that look? Right, we'll go with that. There is a few different other things I could place down here, isn't there? There is the uh, fishing island. This is all fishing stuff. We've got uh, a dog park. Should I place down some smaller parks? Just there. And whatnot. So you can just quickly walk your dog before you go in. Oh, this is so cool. Right, nobody's coming to visit because you don't have the road connected. So let's do that. So connect the road there. Nice and simple and basic connections. There we go. Right, sweet. We've got our nice little nature reserve in. So we do need a little bit of power. We'll go for the parking shelter power. That should do the trick. Yep, they should now all have power. Beautiful. Oh, it's so good that is. I'm so impressed with it. Right, we now just gotta wait for people to arrive. Uh, this residential area taking some time to get built, but we have dropped. We have dropped quite a bit of uh, residential demand. So it, again, it would take some time to get all that set up. So do we put in some commercial? I don't know. How is that road down here doing? Oh, we need. Uh, oh, there's some issues over here, isn't there? Yeah, huge garbage issues. Okay. So let's get, um, let's see, let's get a, should we get like a, we have recycling centers here, but they're not, seem to do the job. Then again, it is a one-way system. So it might be beneficial then if we have a recycling center just there. So with that there, oh, there seems to be an issue here with the bus route. I would normally find if you move the stop and then move it back. Seems to fix the issue, but this doesn't even want to be connected. So 
So put that there, add a stop that no, don't not gonna create a new line. Add a stop there, but then move that one to there. Where does it need to get connected to? Right, that's this line, right? Is it this line? Yeah. So at some point, it's not connected somewhere. I'm trying to figure out where it goes to now. This is kind of weird, isn't it? So it goes around to there. Ah, there we go. There's the there's where it doesn't want to connect. So if that was moved to there. There we go. Okay, they can walk from there to there, which is fine. So that's now so is that solved the garbage issue? By the way? One truck in use. Is it just gone out? I think it's just gone out, hasn't it? Biofuel garbage truck. Is that from here? I think it's just gone out, hasn't it? Where's it going to go? Is it going to go down there? No, okay. He's coming around then. Should I then should start taking up some of this stuff? I don't know if it, it will get that one because it's on this road. Okay, the first set of garbage is here or there, depending on which way it turns. That then should start getting rid of the garbage then. Which it doesn't seem to want to do. <laughs> right, there's another garbage truck. Is that a garbage truck? No, it's a van. What? What's with the garbage issues, man? I'll we'll place a small one in here. A small one there. All right, there you go. He's coming out now. Is he going to do the job? There's some garbage up here. It's already returning to facility. Like, it's already, like, full. Well, right, we'll let that do what it's going to do. All right, is anybody coming up here? Yes, we seem to have quite a few cars now coming up here. Nice. Uh, we, we need garbage disposal, which is inevitable. So do I make, well, ultimately, we need to connect this road up there too, so. So if I brought that to there and then create a nice little bend like that. Then garbage needs, they almost reach up to there. But we'll see how it goes. We'll see literally how it goes. This seems to be so annoying over here right now. Oh, is that another, gar yeah, another garbage truck is on the way. It's moving, it's making shakes. It's turning. Will it go and collect all this stuff? This garbage truck? Doesn't seem to want it. But then it gets on the wrong side of the road, doesn't it? Oh, this one's coming down now. Will this one get it? No. Garbage seems to be a weird issue over here. Not enough raw materials, too. Hmm. I'm not seeing as many vehicles now come down here as well, which is really weird. Have they all chose to take a different... Export route. I feel like they slightly have. But which one have they chose? That is the question. Nobody knows. But I think we're going to be here. Look how good that national park now looks. The Cypress National Park. On top of the hill. People are coming to it. Are there, is there people walking around there now? Yes. Anybody on the edge of the outlooks? 
Oh, there's one person there. Who is it? It's Emma Mason. She's on the viewing deck, looking at nature. It's a good view. Very impressed. Very impressed. Hope you guys did enjoy this episode then. Uh, for next episode, I'll sort out what is going down right now with all these raw issue problems. Uh, raw issues, I mean raw material problems. We could need... Maybe, let me know what you think about this. Maybe I should build an airport with a cargo hub, like the cargo hub airport. That'll bring in a lot of materials. Could even place it there, or over here, or somewhere up there, something like that. Have a secondary airport, just, just for cargo anyway, just for cargo. This one's doing a good job, but you know. We need better stuff. We need better stuff, guys. Let me know in the comment section down below. But I hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, smash that like button down below. And until next time, I'll see you all soon. So, goodbye.